Hello students, this is BS Academy classes presented by Sandeep. Students, in the last few lecture, I discussed the data interpretation part and the number system thoroughly. And in the few lecture, I also discussed the research methodology topics and the teaching aptitude topics. Okay. So in this lecture, I will take another topic of research methodology, which is research design, and I will cover this thoroughly. So students, many of you written me mail about wrote me mail about the uh, what kind of study you should people follow in your. Uh, UGC night paper. I will discuss all these things in the future's lecture. Okay, so in this part, I will discuss the research design and what are the important topics uh, under the uh, under this uh, under the category of research design which we will study in the future. Okay, so please students note down all these important topic because these topics are very important for your exam point of view and uh, many uh, times the 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 question, different type of question asked about this uh, research design topic okay so uh, in this topic i will take the first the what are the important topics which i will cover in the research design and also i will discuss also the meaning of research design so here the first two important point comes out of our mind is the that why should we uh, what is the meaning of research design so in the research design i will discuss the different type of uh, definition and a different type of uh, scholars definition which you, they cover in the research design and also the first uh, the there are important topics which come in the research design like uh, what are the purpose of research design and what is what are the why we go for the research design need for the research design so uh, first uh, because the research design is something like blueprint of the master plan or, or the master plan for uh, any researcher because they uh, there are different type of alternative alternatives that they that we, we will uh, cover in our research design so they uh, for example if suppose that you uh, use uh, one strategy and this strategy fail after some time then what are the different type of alternatives uh, we, we should we, we will cover in uh, our research design so these are some of the important uh, important uh, points which you uh, every researcher adopt in their research design then the next important topic comes into the category of research design is what are the different type of features or the characteristic of good research design for example if you follow uh, what if you if you want to uh, uh, design a good research design one then what are the important topic or what are the important characteristic suppose that because in because the research is very um, time consuming and also so you should adopt only those strategy which uh, gives us very good results uh, also they consume less time so what are the different type of characteristic or what are the important uh, research plan for designing the research design i will definitely uh, address all this issue then next important topic is what are the important topics what are the important topics and or, or the important concepts related to research, research design then next important topic is what are the what are the what are the important criteria for selection of research design for example if you want to uh, select a uh, uh, good research design for your uh, uh, research then what are the important uh, important criteria which we will follow in our uh, to select that particular research design but because the research design is totally dependent on uh, for example location of a research your time for research time of research also the the place of research so all these important uh, topics come on such a category of selection of research design and also your budget part also uh, very crucial for your selection of research design and also the your what kind of data selection strategy you adopt in your research design so these are different type of uh, selection criteria in which we will select our research design the next important topic is what are different type of research uh, what are the what are the different type of research design which which we will cover in, in thoroughly so suppose that if you uh, if your research topic is related to science then what kind of what type of research plan we have research design we have under the category of science topic and also inside the for example if i choose the any sociology topic uh, for example if i select uh, what are the different uh, benefits available in the old age for the uh, for, for all for all old people then what kind of research design i should adopt in our uh, in our plan or in our research so the, the, there are different type of uh, different type of research design which we will follow or which every researcher want to uh, highlight some of their points okay so these are some of the uh, important design okay then next important topic is what are the basic principle involving to select the research design so students these are some of the important topic which i will cover and also please students note down all this all this point and please 
uh, highlight all this issue in your uh, notebook or the your register because because suppose that in, uh, if I missed uh, any of this topic, so you should uh, you should uh, cover this all topic for your also in, in your self study part because self study very important for any exam point of view. So if you don't just study yourself, then you nobody can uh, again succeed in their in their examination. Okay. So these are some of the research design topic which I will cover in the future. Then the first com point comes in our mind is what is the meaning of research design? So students the Oh, yeah, its name is suggesting that it is it is the designing of research. So it is nothing but the arrangement of conditions. I already told you. If suppose that one strategy or one uh, alternative fail for your research, then what are the different type of alternatives or the strategy or the different type of conditions or different type of problems comes in under the uh, under category of our research. Uh, uh, so all these are nothing but the arrangement of conditions and different type of testing plan we adopt in our research plan. Okay, So these are some of the important topics or important arrangement which every researcher wants to follow in their research design. Then the next important topic, next, next important concept is or it is nothing but the overall strategy of research plan. So, uh, because uh, in the last lecture I discussed the there are some around nine to ten important steps or the uh, important steps inside the RM part. So each and each 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 and every uh, block block of that particular diagram play a very crucial role in our uh, study. So this is nothing but it is a overall strategy and what kind of strategy I will uh, adopt to attain to complete our research. So this different type of um, questions come always come in our mind. If suppose that one study fails, then what what are the different type of study available for any researcher? So this is very important, and this is also uh, the nothing but the meaning of research design. Then the uh, inside the category of meaning, then we have different type of research operation which uh, any researcher implement in their research plan. So to implement that particular research operation is also nothing but the nothing but the to implement that particular research design then the research design is nothing but the it is a blueprint or the master plan for any researcher and also for the your research also and the next important uh, next meaning is that uh, that is that it guide the researcher it suppose because the the research is done by one researcher or sometimes it is done by the group of researchers so it is nothing but the it is a guideline which each and every researcher in the group adopt that particular guideline okay then it will help in the decision making because uh, in each and every strategy uh, in every uh, stage also we have sometimes we have to take a very crucial decision for our to complete that particular research suppose that if uh, one particular type of uh, data uh, one particular type of uh, data collection strategy fail then we will uh, select any other type of data collection strategy. So these are some of the important meanings of research design. So student, I, I, I first of all I revise all these points which I cover. Now uh, this inside the research design, I will cover the I already cover the meaning of research design and also the purpose and need for the research design. Then what are the important characteristics and the good features of research design? Then the important concept and important points relating to research design. And also, what are the different type of criteria on the basis of that we will select our research design. Then, the, what are the different type of research design available uh, for any researcher, and what type of different type of literature review available for the research design. And also, what are the different type of basic principle available to complete our research. Then, this is all about your research design, and I will definitely cover all this point in your future. Then, I also cover covered the mean. What is what is the meaning of research design? It is nothing but the it is the arrangement of conditions, your testing, your alternatives, and different type of problem comes under the category of research design. And also, it is a whole strategy for your research uh, because your uh, your research is always a time uh, time bound time foundation to complete that particular research in, in a very time complete foundation. We will uh, have some strategy to uh, to attain that particular goal. Then uh, next is the to implement the research operation and also we it is the blueprint or the master plan for our research design and also for, not for research design but for our research then it is the guideline or the mind map for the researchers and also it helps in our 
to take our decision in our research design okay so students uh, uh, this is this is just like a, a very, very small introduction for our research design and i will definitely cover all important other topic which you, uh, which is very crucial for your study also okay if you still face any problem or any difficulty in your study you can write your you can write me your email okay and i will definitely uh, highlight all the issues and all the problem you, which you are facing right now okay students thank you